Hello and welcome to my channel, Scotland Mushroom Falls again fishing. Today I want to present something to you which is called the Hen of the Woods or Metaki, uh, which I found yesterday. Mainly you will find the Hen of the Woods in the bottom of oak trees or other hardwood trees, but mainly they prefer oak trees. And so, yeah, they're not very common in the UK. So if you do find one on the side of the road or wherever, stop and take it because you might not get another chance in the year. So they're not very common and this one for the UK is quite a good good size but they can grow huge in the in America. I read reports of about 80 pounds or more. So well so basically they're dark grey to black in this case they're more so like dark brownish so the light is not very good so so but the white uh, the flesh is white and also the, the pores are white and it has a white spore print it's the flesh is very very firm and it's got a nice smell to it and it's a good eating one and also it's very good for freezing either after cooking or before raw yeah and it's like peel a bit like chicken breast so structurally wise texture wise is probably similar a bit similar like chicken of the woods so they have shelf layers so basically well, let's just go you can see the underside all is like shelf on top of each other they're quite easy to identify because the, the caps are not are not big they can probably get bigger than this but the only other one I know who could compare with it is the giant polypore which is also edible but it's not very nice so they can get really big each individual uh, cap so apart from from this I don't know if there's anything else so the only thing is what is tedious with this is cleaning them. You can have creepy crawlies in there, bugs. So the way I, I prefer to do it is break it into pieces and then put it into salt water. Creepy crawlies don't like salt water, so hopefully they will pop up. And then you can scoop them up. And then you can let it, let let the fungi dry again, and then yeah you can do cook it or freeze it. So I I usually freeze most of it so I I, can, I have plenty for throughout the year. But I don't know if I will find another one this year. Uh, but also they they grow back in the same tree in the same spot for a few years. So if you're lucky enough you identify the tree and you live quite close by it so you can go there every year and see if it comes back. So yeah I just want to introduce you on this lovely lovely uh, mushroom, the hen of the woods or cheetah. See you've got, you've got a bug here. I didn't even know it was on there. You got a little wood logs there. See? So 
If you don't scream with bugs, so uh, you should be alright. Yeah, just a bit, just put it in the bin. So, yeah, you should try it. I like it. I think the Latin name is Crivula Frondosa. I think. I, I put the Latin name in the bottom of the screen anyway. I'm not very good with Latin. <laughs> so, yeah. I hope you find it useful. Hopefully you find one. And let me know how you get on. If you find one. If you like it or not. So, I definitely, I definitely like it. So, I like the texture. It's quite a firm texture. So, any questions? Leave them in the comments. Or if you found one and you're not sure, send me a picture on Facebook. I'm on the Facebook group. Yeah. And until then, 